Alrighty, hey guys, welcome back to another quick tutorial slash uh, showcase. And today we're going to be talking about the Forsaken Power called the Eichther. I think that's what it's called. Don't quote me. I'm not good with pronunciations, but it is what it is. So what this does, it, it gives your um, a real big boost to how little stamina you use whenever you jump or you run. It's good to travel long distances. And uh, overall, I think it's pretty strong. And you do get it early on. You get it in the first boss. And uh, let me just quickly activate it. You press F to a activate these powers once you do get them. So we're going to press F. Boom. And as you can see, now stamina-wise, we are barely using any. And it's going down very, very slow. And this is really good if you want to travel a far distance or whatever, something like that. Or run away from somebody. Very good in my opinion. And also, this lasts for 5 minutes. And after the 5 minutes is up, it's a 15-minute cooldown. So keep that in mind. And uh, to get this one, you need to defeat the first boss. It is the deer boss right here. And uh, pretty much to activate the power, you need to put the trophy you get from the deer boss onto this. Um, you start at the map right here, these like little summoning stones. And you need to put it literally on this first stone that has the deer on it, right? And if you want to find out where they're located, all you have to do is literally when you spawn, uh, what's called register this location and boom. There's a location on your map. It's not going to be the same as mine. Obviously, all maps are generated uh, randomly. But literally, when you spawn into the game, you can register the location, find him. And once you actually get to him, let's go to him. Just so I could uh, show everything off that you can about this. Alrighty, now that we're here, we're at the boss location. As you can see, you will be asked to offer an item to summon the boss. And you could also read the rune stone right here. And it's going to tell you to hunt his kin which is pretty much, if you look right up, is deers. So what you wanna do is um, offer them, uh, what, are, what do you call them, deer trophies. I'm not gonna activate it right now, but I am gonna show you gameplay of me actually activating the boss and fighting the boss right after I finish explaining it. So you put the deer trophies, let's say in seven, and then you would click seven in this, uh, what's called in this example, or where, wherever you place it on your hotbar. It would offer the, um, the offer, offering would start, and then uh, the boss will be spawned. You fight the boss, and at the end, you get his, um, what would you call it? That big uh, trophy that you saw on the ruin stone, uh, right at, at this area, right over here. And once you actually uh, put it on the ruin stone, your ability will be activated, and you can press F to use it. And that's pretty much it. That's all you really need to know about it. Let me just show it one more time right over here. It's very easy to get, and also um, the easiest way to beat the boss, get a lot of arrows, make sure you're well rested, and uh, make sure you have some good food, good cooked food, so your health is above 100 like you see. I have it, and uh, you should be good to go. Not a very hard boss, but uh, here's me fighting the boss. Hunt his kin, which looks like the deer. Now let's offer him. Oh, it worked. Okay, you got two deer trophies. Oh, he's coming, he's coming, he's coming. There he is, my boy. My boy. A little bit bigger deer. A little bit... Oh, you, you, I don't know what you do. I don't know, I don't know what type of damage you do. Oh, you got some shock damage. Okay. Oh, There it is, baby. My boy. My boy down. What do I got? Yes. Okay, so that is how you get the antler pickaxe. Cool. Nice. I'll sacrifice real quick. This is the place, right? Yeah, this is for the... 
Okay. How do I sacrifice it? Oh. Attach item. There it is. Your ability to run and jump is improved. That's crazy. What? You've been granted the power of that. Use it in times of need. Your next target dwells in the Black Forest. Go there, explore the lands, and discover the lost. The Elder awaits. Okay, so we already have the Elder. So... Oh, and how do I use that skill then? Okay, so if I press... Oh boy, okay. Oh, and I can only use it every 20 minutes. So you want to use it for like big boss fights and stuff. Interesting. Alrighty, definitely cool.